TOA community, what's up everybody? Robert Linkle, trainingtheolderadult.com. Mrs. Linkle, Mrs. TOA in the house. She's gonna join us here for a little reaction video. She hasn't seen this yet <laughs> and I don't like looking at it. So um, this is something, I feel like this is one of those things that I'm not doing our people and our community a service if I don't show you something like this because it's one of those things that I'm seeing pop up on videos over and over again. And I personally feel like it's really dangerous and you've got some really high level athletes and, and very strong individuals that can do it. So they do it and then kind of regular folks try it and you'll see what happens. So um, this is one of those super exceptional athletes that you'll see on Mr. James CPT, his client, I think her name's Kate or Kelly or something like that. She's hooked into a tricep extension, like dip harness belt around a post. And this is uh, hooked in behind her tibia and fibula. And she's basically going into a quad extension, like a very advanced sissy squat, okay? Is, is more or less how we've seen this. Mark Wahlberg has done this, The Rock has done this. There are multiple different, there are multiple different tools, like you're gonna see this gentleman using this device right here, okay? I'm scared. And, <laughs> and this is a guy who, number one, I think in the description when I read it, he said this was my first time doing it, oh. and he's holding a 45 pound plate. So just observe what happens wow. to him. Oh, oh fuck, I can't even look at it. I can't oh, look at terrible. it. I know, I know it's happening and I can't watch it. This messes with my brain so much, but you can see the dent in his knee, okay? Um, I've seen people do this with just their body weight, and they're not even going all the way back. They're just doing the squat, gang. They're not, they're not doing the straight bend where they're going. They're literally just doing a squat, like a true sissy squat, and their kneecap just blows apart. It's too much quad. It's too much stress. Your body is used to having a fulcrum at the knee that allows it to shift and move, and now that fulcrum is stuck and just the patella, in this case, your, your ACL, this dude's ACL just blew apart. Let's watch it again. Let's make sure everybody, let's make sure everybody can see exactly, here's what it's supposed to look like. Pretty special lady, I can't watch it again. Oh, God, it makes me sick. It almost just looks like he falls down. You don't just know stare right happens. at his knee, just stare right at his knee. stare right at his knee. Ugh. Oh, 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 it messes with me, I feel it. So I feel bet you there were some- Down deep, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Really nice oh, ladies. Oh, really nice ladies were watching, and and he was looking really cool. That Cecil. Now you're cool in the hospital. Single. Fuck that. Single I mean, that's all I got to say about that. There's there's so many other ways to train your quads to in your in your ACL. Now, now let me let me say this because people are like, well, what is this exercise for? Do you know what it's for? Rehabilitating your ACL. <laughs> <laughs> which is funny because everybody tears it doing it that, yeah and it's like it's you you went from um I'm learning how to walk to I'm sprinting in the 100 meter Olympic final like you you went right to the hardest thing possible not only are you short fulcrum in a sissy squat like this you're deciding to go past the squat you're going to go into the full back bend and you're holding a weight and he's probably close to six foot, if not more. Does it show him like getting up and? I don't know. I mean, no, the video ends right there and his leg is blown apart. There are so many videos of this happening on there. It's either their ACL goes or their um, medial meniscus or their MCL, which is your unhappy triad, if all three of those go, or it's the patella snapping, which you're in bad shape. Let me tell you, if your patellar tendon snaps, okay? This is, the patellar tendon is the part from the patella, the bone, the bony part of your kneecap that floats around. All four of your quadriceps attach to that. They insert there, it goes over the top of the kneecap and the tendon holds the patella to the tibia, right? To the front of your leg. So if that snaps, think of uh, the, the, the window shade, what happens to your quads? They go all the way up, back up into your leg because there's nothing holding them down there anymore, okay? So your leg just doesn't work anymore. Your knees will not extend. You're in massive amounts of pain. He didn't cry out. I, he took it like a champ. Number one, you, you, I mean, everybody in the gym just went, oh shit, did you see that, right? <laughs> everybody just did that. And then they go, oh yeah, just pretend like nothing happened, right? Everybody just did that. But he, that plate landed right on top of him, okay? And then, oh, I got another one where this guy, we're not gonna do it now, okay. but a guy is doing a, a push-up with a 45 pound plate on his back. Mm. 
and he goes to get rid of the plate by sliding it off. So gross. Do you want to see it? Of course you do. Of course you want to see it. I was going to say it. Yes, you do. You know you want to see it. Wait, Here, please, please hold. Oh, it doesn't like cut it off, but it's not pretty. Here we go. Watch this. Here, it'll play. It'll play again. Sorry for the, the poor clarity. Look at that. Ugh. And then he's like, oh, I think I broke it. No shit, you think you broke it. Here, let's try this again. Come on back. Come on back. One more time. What's going on? I recorded all the ads. <laughs> oh, I got it a second time. Did I get a second time? Oh, yeah, yeah. This guy shows the x-ray. Okay, watch this. Drops off right on his uh. hand. Oh, and then he comes hurt. back and he shows you. Hey, look, look at the dent. How stupid was that? What a dumbass this guy makes fun of him. You think so? You think it's broken? You think you broke it, champ? Yeah, yeah, you broke it. You completely smashed that thing. I mean, why would you roll why? Off I, I don't know. And that's, that's I mean, 45 good, pounds. Going all the way down to the ground that's 45 off. pounds of that plate just smashing onto your, I'm not the best video from phone to camera, but you get the point. <laughs> it's terrible. Just don't do, there's, this is supposed to be simple, gang. It's supposed to be safe, right? There's so many other ways to train your quads and to get a really good quad pump and to build the thighs you've always wanted by not doing that and not blowing apart your legs and hurting yourself. Well, I think people do things like that because it, it, they feel like it looks neat and it's probably harder than it is. And so then like you get, you know, you've been caught in the, I don't know, what's that one where you like, um, you're on like a decline bench and your feet are hooked in, it's like an ab thing. Mm -hmm. And then you take like your med ball and you go like side to side or whatever, you know, it's like. Mm -hmm. Decline, you know, Russian years twist. Ago, kind yeah, of yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So but I blew my back apart doing that, but Yeah, right. So it's one I of those just didn't things. have Instagram to record myself <laughs> when I was doing it. It's one of those things that you see someone doing, you're like, oh, well, that looks really hard. Like, I'll try it. And so you do it and it's not as hard as it looks, but it's useless, right? But it looks cool, but it's useless. Like that's the thing is that you think people are trying to reinvent the wheel and look cool and feel cool and you know they just need a better self esteem. I would feel I would feel <laughs> I would feel better that's about it. Get roped into this bullshit. I feel better about it if he didn't have video because then at least he was just trying it. But he was like, I'm gonna look cool right now. I'm gonna set up my camera I mean, every, and watch my got knee 2. blow 2, apart. Two thousand comments and two point nine shares. I mean, and like a million worked. views. Yeah, yeah. Watching. I mean, he's famous. I've watched it fifty times. I can't look at it after the first time. It's now ingrained into my brain. Thanks a lot, John. John was the one that sent this to me. John loves to send this me one's stuff. Not near as bad and as he's like, I, he knows I don't like to see this stuff, and so he's like. This guy's amazing. Check him out. And then I open the video and it's some guy dumping the bar on the back of his head. And he's like, <laughs> gotcha. Jerk. <laughs> he gets me every time. And every time I'm like, oh, an amazing feat from John. Mm -hmm. Every time. Sucker. Awful. I am a sucker. <laughs> anyway, don't do that. Thanks for viewing. Yeah, you This is bet. more fun Thanks. with you here. Totally. I'm it's sure It's nice to it have is. someone else to I'm talk sure to. I mean, it's great to talk to all you guys, but big problem. You don't talk back. The problem is the censorship. I can't hear you. I have to like. I don't know. I dropped some f bombs. I want to see those. <laughs> She's got some weird shit going on in her head. <laughs> all right, we're gonna get out of here. Much love and appreciation to all of you out there. Love for everybody. Let's throw out some hearts to everybody. In are they on fire? Oh yeah. There's oh. mine. Oh yeah. There we go. There we go. All right, we're out of here. Love you, everybody. Continue to fight your good fight against Circopenia. Peace. Yeah, by not doing that.